Today we're going to look at the car throttle body. This one's from an MX-5. Its location is between the air intake filter and the intake manifold. And it acts like a valve restricting the amount of air that goes into the engine. So basically when you push down the throttle, your gas pedal in your car, it opens the valve up like this and allows more air into the engine. So the more air that goes into the engine, the more fuel, the more power there is, and the revs go up in the car. In theory, the bigger the throttle body, the more air that can go through, and therefore more power. So let's look at the parts of the throttle body. So this is the mechanism here that operates the valve. So it's connected by the throttle body cable. So when you push down the gas pedal, it opens the valve up. So when you push down the gas pedal on your car, this opens up the valve and this allows more air into the intake manifold. So the valve inside here is called a butterfly valve. So on the side here is the throttle position sensor. So it tells the engine how open the throttle is. So up here on the valve assembly is the idle air control valve or IAC and this opens and closes to keep the idle steady. So that's the main bits dealt with. So let's look at the other parts. We have the throttle body stop screw here, which keeps the closed position in place and tells it where to stop. We also have some coolant hoses up here, and this runs coolant through the throttle body to keep it warm if you're operating in cool climates. So we also have a map sensor. So you see this little passage here. So this detects the pressure behind the butterfly valve and it lets the engine know with higher pressure to inject more fuel. As we can see there's a little hole here and this is for the IAC valve and it's used to control the amount of air that gets in during idle. Lastly we've got the idle adjustment screw here and this lets you adjust the amount of airflow during idle and this obviously affects the idle speed.